This land is your land. This land is my land. From California, well, to the New York Island. From the Redwood Forest to the Gulf. Welcome to Marky's World, and I'm your host, Marky Sheehan. And who I have here with me is the president of the Richton Park Village. Welcome. And welcome to you, too. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you know, it's a pleasure to uh, interview you. I've read so much about you from before. One of the reasons why I would like to share my friend with you is because he is a person of the people. And what I mean by that is he's done so much for so many other people, and he really leaves an impression on a person. And we'll get into that a little more. But first, I'm going to talk about him and he being, uh, I'm so used to saying mayor. Mm -hmm. and this is why I'm stumbling. The, the word mayor how did they turn those words around like that? Can you tell me that? <laughs> sure, sure. It's, it's the way the uh, municipality was incorporated. Mm -hmm. If a municipality is incorporated or created as a village, that form of government is with a village president and a board of trustees. If, if a municipality is incorporated originally as a city, then they have a mayor and councilman. But in Illinois, if you're a village president, they have a, actually a statute that allows village presidents to be addressed as mayor, uh, but it doesn't allow mayors to be addressed as village presidents. Oh, so it's a, it's a little special. So either one is appropriate. Okay. And you were a trustee before. Yes. And then, when was it, 2001 or? I believe, yes, it was 2001, I was a trustee for eight years, mm -hmm. and then became village president in 2001, and, I, and I'm currently in my fifth term as village president. See, you didn't know that I knew all that about you, No, you did your homework. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm flattered. <laughs> yes, yeah, so, uh, and now you're the president. Yes. Yeah. So what are your, some of your goals as being the president? We, we want Richton Park uh, to continue to be a vibrant community. Mm -hmm. We have opportunities for growth in our village, so we're very, very fortunate. Uh, some communities are landlocked. Their, their, their borders are uh, abut up to other communities. But we've got a great deal of opportunity to expand out west of the village mm -hmm. and even south of the village. So as uh, a Bayer friend once told me years ago, if, as a community, he says, if you're not moving forward all the time, you're going backwards. Yeah. And that's something that's always stuck with me. I, I, I want us to continue to grow because that makes us attractive for anybody that wants to come to a community. Uh, everybody wants to come to a community that's a vibrant. Yeah, and how did you develop this personality where uh, your residents or your uh, citizens mm -hmm. really love you? Well, I, I guess in that regard, <laughs> I'm blessed. I, I, if there was a road map of how I did it, I, I couldn't tell you, but I, I guess I would have to say just be yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, if, uh, if, if someone isn't genuine in, in how they feel about their community and their residents, I, I think people can pick up on that pretty pretty quickly. Some, some people uh, use the office of village president or mayor to uh, perhaps go to the next level mm -hmm. or do something else. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and I have, I don't covet any higher job. You know, I love my community. It's uh, when I was born and they took me home, my parents took me home from the hospital, they took me to Richton Park. Uh, oh, so, so you've been here all your life. Yes, yes. Okay. E except for, uh, I was in the, the military uh, okay. for uh, a little over seven years. And then I worked for a, a stint in the Gulf of Mexico. What, a what uh, branch of the military? I was I was a, in the Navy and I was a diver. So when I got oh, out of the wow. Navy, I was able to work in the uh, oil industry as a commercial diver. See that? Now I didn't know all that about you. <laughs> <laughs> My goodness. 
Oh, wow. That, I mean, that's uh, impressive. Yeah, that's was, something to really uh, think about. That's very impressive. Uh, so after, let's talk about more on you. Mm -hmm. So your parents brought you home to Richardson Park, mm -hmm. and you went to school, you went to high school right here. Yes. And um, what are some of your, or what were some of your goals? What did you think that you were going to uh, amount to? Out of high school? Uh-huh. Well, if you would have told me out of high school that I would grow up to be the mayor of Richmond Park, I, I would have said absolutely not. You know, mm -hmm. there's, and even after the military, I, uh, I never really aspired to public office. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, but there was an opportunity on the board as an uh, opening for trustee, and uh, the board very well intended good people, uh, but there, what I observed was there was no uh, there weren't any entrepreneurs or business people on the board. Oh, okay. So I, I thought I would have something to offer by bringing that perspective to mm -hmm. government uh, of an entrepreneur, a local businessman. So that was my uh, initial reason for running. I wanted to contribute. Oh, right, right. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that sounds wonderful. And then uh, how about your parents? Are they proud of you? I know well, they are. <laughs> yeah, well, my parents have passed, but, but, uh, but yeah, I, they're very proud of me when I was a young lad. I, um, I was uh, a challenge uh, mm -hmm. for my parents. Uh, no, was, uh, come on yeah, now. I know. <laughs> I know it's, 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 <laughs> I guess it's uh, my, uh, my confession to some degree. But I was, uh, as a young man, I made some mistakes. Yeah, uh, but that's being human. It, it's been very human, and uh, over the course of time, I've actually run into some of um, some of my teachers, and I ran into one of them a few years ago, and said hello, and he said, he says, well, what are you doing? And I said, uh, I said, well, I'm, I'm the mayor of Richardson Park now, and, oh. and he just started laughing, and he was <laughs> laughing, and he said, uh, he said, you know, you were always always kidding around in school. Mm -hmm. He says, but seriously, he said, what are you doing now? Oh, oh, oh. oh that is so wonderful. That is so wonderful. I, man, I, I really wished I could have learned more about you even this uh, during this uh, mm -hmm. interview. But that that's, that's interesting. Now, uh, I met Mathiel Gibbons. Mm -hmm. And Mathiel Gibbons, this is how you were introduced to me, Adele Gibbons, she had always spoken so highly of you. That's all she, I mean, I, in fact, I saw you at the, the play. Oh, all right. Yeah, okay. yeah. Part four, you, sure. were, you were given, I, I don't know if it's like a speech, but you mm -hmm. were saying hi. And um, you seemed to be very, uh, very nice then. And Mathiel, uh She's been on her little journey, mm -hmm. and you know we wish her all the luck in the world, sure. and we're trying. Everybody's, you know, really trying to promote her as much as possible because she's going places. Absolutely, she's actually going places. She's putting that foot forward, and she's moving out uh, with from the book to the play to the movies, and it, it's gonna happen. And so, Matteo, uh, can we can we bring her on right Absolutely. now? Absolutely, Matteo, come on down. <laughs> hmm. Where's the gavel at? <laughs> <laughs> what an honor! <laughs> it is an honor. This is more than an honor. <laughs> this is Matteo hmm. Gibbons. <clears throat> Matteo. Tell us a little something about the book that you wrote and what you have here. This is the this is your magazine. Yes, yes. Okay, tell us something about that. Well, uh, we just recently started, uh, uh, or we restarted a publication in the village. It's called the uh, Richmond Park Review, and it's it tells um, not only uh, stories of, or activities in the village or things that we're mm -hmm. planning, but we also uh, feature. Uh, very prominent and, and important individuals in our community. And in the first uh, edition, we were quite honored and pleased 
to be able to introduce the rest of our community to Mathel and tell a little bit about her remarkable journey in life mm -hmm. and, and the challenges that she's overcome and continued to overcome. And, and she's an inspiration to all of us yeah. uh, on Thank a daily you. basis. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. So we're, we're fortunate. I'm most honored. <laughs> you better believe I don't take that lightly. And um, I can't tell you how much I appreciate you and the full team out of everybody in the village that I would be selected first to be in your first issue. It's just, it's boosting me to the next level. Mm -hmm. I'm ready Great. to go for this movie now. Yes. I'm seeking to get higher and I would like to do it right here in my village. Oh, wow, that would be <laughs> wonderful. Would love that yes. would be wonderful. Yes, I, would like, I just need to attract the filmmakers. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. as soon as I do, watch it. All right? Oh, don't, don't worry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> don't say you just need to just say it. You're going to attract it. You know, that's all. Just put it out there that's and it's going to happen. Well, you're a filmmaker. Look at you. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. Got you right here. It's you a got, a, start. You got a mayor right here. And you're encouraging me, and he definitely has set fire to my whole world. So, now, yeah. tell me, how did you feel when you met him? I mean, because he's he's impressed. I mean, he's a, uh, I forget. Uh, I cannot use the word impressionable. I okay. found out that that's oh. not what it means. Oh, okay. it's, a, it's, it's a babble word. Okay. It's, it's, oh, okay. Babble. Impressionable and the word nice. Do okay. I do so? so <laughs> but he's a great person. Absolutely. Phenomenal. Thank you. Thank you. I always tell him, I say, you know, you're the highest man in the village. <laughs> and with my uh, book being Angels in My Life, mm -hmm. man, he's the highest angel here in Richmond Park. Thank you. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, quite a blessing to have been introduced to him through Julian Alexander. Yes. Uh, he's one of, I'm telling you, just, I met Julian at a church right down the street 11 years ago. Mm -hmm. And I said, you know, I'm going to get on that team and I'm going to help. I said, so you can count on me to help. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And sure enough, the next thing I knew, I was meeting the mayor of Richmond Park. And he's just such a personable person. I'm just like, man. How wonderful is that? It's like a friend. It's like my big brother. <laughs> right? He could, he, he could put you at ease. I'm, and I want to thank you for that. You could actually put a person at, at ease. Thank you. That's great. Mm -hmm. Just his genuine look. He has that mm -hmm. smile all the time. He looks know. like he's bottling. Are, are you yeah. bottling? No. no. <laughs> we just had a picnic, mm -hmm. okay? And it was just so, oh my God, it was amazing to see when it was time for them to look for someone to be dumped in all this water and everybody could throw the ball and he was the one. <laughs> he was the one and he sat up there just as cool and when they hit him, ah, he went down and the water was so cold. It was very cold. <laughs> but it was fun. We now, how great is that? <laughs> That's what it's all about. Yes. Mm -hmm. And interacting very well with your uh, citizens. Yes. yes. That's, that's what it's all about. Some people are not that um, fortunate. Okay. But, uh, you know, some people are. He's loved. Wonderful. I've been to several of the meetings, and everybody loves Mayor Rick Rainbow. That's all I can say. They yes. love him. Mm -hmm. And I have a God love for him. I'm thankful that it was our time to meet. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wonderful. And, and he has a great team here. Just an absolutely great team. That's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, you throw me off when you say mayor. <laughs> <laughs> President. <laughs> President. Okay. President mm -hmm. Ryan Ball. Is there anything you would like to add to this? Well, I, just, I think Mathel touched on it. Our paths crossed just at the right time. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I think there was a need for, for both of us uh, yes. and for our community. And uh, you, you, know when, you know when it feels right. I know, mm -hmm. and I'm sure that you have like thousands of these stories, you know, because you can't just be nice to one person. I, I just don't see that your personality just yeah. overruns, you, you know. 
uh, I, I don't see that happening. I can see you just, whoever comes up on He's you. Love. Oh. Yeah, I yeah. can see that. He's I love see. all by itself. <laughs> oh, that is um, I'm, I'm fortunate uh, being able to live in a community. Five generations of my family have mm -hmm. called Richton Park home over the years. My grandfather was a developer and my dad was a builder for a period. Uh, so I, I really just grew up in the community and uh, I was in the service for a little while and uh, worked in the Gulf, but after that came back uh, and it was almost like I had never left. Yeah, uh, wow. yeah well that's, that's good. I got married and yep. so on yep. and so on. That's great. So it's just, uh, and when I calculate the one day a week fasting, it, I don't eat for two months out of the year. When, you, know, you figure 52. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, that's good. Yeah, yes. so it's, uh, and it works. You know, and you know what? And it makes a big difference because you notice that they said if you cut off soda, that takes 15 pounds off of you for a year. Yeah. Wow. You know, so something like that, that means a, a lot. Yes. But yeah. What you do now has a great effect a year later. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. If you continue to do it. Yeah. What I love about him, he's not conceited. <laughs> I don't even think you can see the Very handsome and I'm just, he's just like, hey, you all. Oh, I, I, oh my God, I can see everybody. I love it. Next time, I, next time you see me, I'll be at the hangs. She's hanging all over. Oh, wow. She have a nap. And they'll be like, oh, you know what? She's never acted like that before. <laughs> Oh, Life boy. is good though. Is. Yeah, I'm blessed. I, I'm blessed every day. Mm -hmm. Yes, you we, are. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, remember, we're here in the village of Richton Park with our mayor, our president. Yes. Uh, not our, but I wish I was one of you. <laughs> we, we have housing opportunities available okay. in the Richton Park. Love to have. Okay, you. I'll just be adopting you. <laughs> That's it. Okay. <laughs> okay. So uh, thank you thank for being you. on Marcus World, and I really appreciate it. And I'll be getting in touch with you soon. Great. Very good. Thank you. And thank you too, uh, Mathel. It's I an honor really and a pleasure. Okay. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye. This land is your land. This land.